Over the past few years, clinical placements for students have become increasingly scarce thanks to the COVID-19 pandemic. This shortage is especially problematic for specialty areas like maternal health. Students are left with minimal hands-on experience during labor, birth, and the postpartum period. Replacing clinical hours with simulation is the obvious answer to this bottleneck, but programs do not always have the funds to purchase expensive mannequins and birthing beds. Today, I'll share some innovative strategies that transform basic mannequins into high fidelity OB simulators for instructors on a limited budget. For instance, the SimVS fetal monitor and a pregnancy belly can transform a basic rescue mannequin into a laboring mother. The same mannequin can also be used with the SimVS patient monitor and the SimLab Solutions postpartum hemorrhage cart to teach students how to manage this life-threatening complication. Respiratory suppression or hypotension from epidural anesthesia can easily be replicated without breaking the bank. The SimVS fetal monitor displays the mother's vital signs along with the fetal heart rate and uterine contractions. Unlike real fetal monitoring systems, instructors can change any or all of these values in real time in response to student interventions. For added realism, simulated wireless fetal monitoring discs are included along with ECG leads, a BP cuff, and a pulse oximetry sensor. Applying blue eyeshadow to the mannequin's lips is a great way to simulate cyanosis. Yellow nail polish can also be applied to a microbore extension set to create inexpensive, realistic epidural infusion tubing. Preeclampsia is another common complication that students must be prepared to manage. This scenario is easily created with the same mannequin and SimVS fetal monitor. Uterine contractions can even be turned off if the mother's labor has not yet started. Students can use simulated magnesium sulfate to prevent seizures and simulated decadron to accelerate fetal lung maturity. In addition, Diamedical offers Simrx simulated platelets and fresh frozen plasma to treat HELP syndrome. They're available in all eight blood types and can be spiked with real transfusion sets. They are filled with textured fluid and feature realistic labeling with removable barcode stickers. A little glycerin can be dabbed on the mother's forehead to simulate diaphoresis and food coloring can be utilized to create the characteristic dark urine in the mother's Foley catheter bag. One of the scariest scenarios for both students and OB providers is managing an umbilical cord prolapse. Thankfully, our rescue mannequin and CVS system can be used to easily simulate this emergency as well. The SimVS fetal monitor is used to show the characteristic sudden drop in fetal heart rate as well as late D cells. There is no need for a birthing bed either. Instructors can use any hospital bed that can be moved into Trendelenburg, like this Vantage MedSearch Tutor Bed from Diamedical. It even has IV pole mounts on the frame for when the patient is being transported to the operating room. Creating the cord is easy too. Simply loop a short section of blood pressure tubing through the vaginal opening. This rescue mannequin does not have female genitalia, so a handy trick is to place a female calf trainer between its legs. Of course, maternal emergencies can develop after birth as well. Postpartum hemorrhage is the primary cause of maternal mortality, and simulation training can literally make the difference between life and death for these new mothers. This time, the same mannequin is paired with the SimVS patient monitor instead of the fetal monitor. Diamedical and SimLab Solutions are proud to offer a loaded postpartum hemorrhage cart that includes all of the supplies and simulated medications that will be needed. SimRx simulated blood and fresh frozen plasma are perfect for severe hemorrhage scenarios, and a Y-type transfusion set is included in the cart. It's easy to create realistic, reusable simulated blood clots too with expanding foam and red spray paint. They can even be made in different sizes so that learners can approximate the mother's blood loss. For more information on how you can achieve more while spending less, reach out to us here at Diamedical. 
If you'd like to learn more about these products, click the links in the description box below. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow along as we release new videos about medical equipment for simulation. Thanks for watching. This was Tuesday Teachings, helping to bring our products into your practice.